and it began sometime around 9 o'clock at the corner of 9th and Hardesty. What we know now is that one person has died from gunshot wounds. Two other people are in critical condition. We are about two blocks away. We tried to get closer, but police have been expanding this perimeter. We do have a camera, though, closer to the scene. We want to go to that, show you the pictures of what we see happening there. Now, the vehicle was rolling after it left this area where the shooting took place. We're told that it was after it left this scene that it crashed into another car. That car that it crashed into had six kids in the vehicle. All of them, we're told, were injured. Now, police are investigating here at this scene. After the shooting happened and that partial chase, the chase continued. We have more reporting on that where the chase ended, but for right now at this location, police are investigating. We've seen them going up and down different streets looking for evidence. For now, we want to send it back to uh, you in the studio where we have more on where the chase ended. Yeah, Brian, let us now take everybody from where you are in northeast Kansas City to live pictures right now in east Kansas City, the end of this chase. This is roughly 18th and Jackson which is just to the east of the Benton Curve and I-70 there in East Kansas City. Um, we're still gathering information just precisely how this chase ended uh, there. We are, Kristen, and what we have been told by Kansas City, Missouri police is they followed the suspect from the 9th and Hardesty location into this 18th and Jackson. Now, that's a, this is video of that suspect who is actually in custody laying on the ground there. Um, we haven't been told that he's injured or anything. He's just simply in custody at this point. We also had understood that at one point uh, he had actually crashed his car, and that's how police were able to take him in custody. This is a look at the 9th and Hardesty scene, which is still very active. You can see that car tipped over on its side. Six children were inside. They've been transported to an area hospital.